Okay, we we'll go. Hey, sir, sorry for the delay. So you going to a hotel in Pala? Yeah, another place. It's lucky for you, Pala has only one hotel still working. See that man? You won't see any more very soon. And it's probably the last one. Full of rich people. Only money and connections can get you out here. Na 
bloody idiot. Nobody follows the rules anymore. Hey, man, I'm not going to be able to say that. Hey, I'm going to I told him the plane's gone, but they don't believe me. Everyone thinks the big planes are coming back. Who can say anymore? Hey, look at that. I see it. Hey, you lose so much in fire. The spires are going to that thing. Brother, he has such a beautiful bangman with a car, three kettle, a hey, hey, rich man, a brush fire destroyed everything, and now he left the country. Yeah, he'll be great. This is Liberation Radio, speaking the truth for the truth seekers. And the truth is that your country needs you. Beware the evil APR scorch. A plague has gripped our people. They're not fans of the DJ. Maybe his music choices, who knows? And what about some of the checkpoint is all on it? I mean, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go Where are you headed? My passenger, driving him to the hotel mm -hmm. in town. You come from the airport? Yes, sir, the airport. Uh, g gentlemen, you are posted here all day. Now, on my way back, I grab some cold beer. You drink beer? Yep, beer. We drink beer. Hurry up then. Move along. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. I'll see you soon, sir. It's okay, they keep to themselves most of the time. Don't let this concern you, just boys let him up steam, right? You remember how it is. trying to find a way out of the country. Only fools stay in that <laughs> Fools and cab drivers. So good. You tired?
the target's uh, presence in the state continues to be a stabilizing influence. He's largely responsible for the recent influx of weapons into the country and clear violation of the joint signatory framework. His reputation as a dangerous arms dealer is well deserved. Orders are to terminate. Well, that didn't work out the way they planned. I'm still breathing and you're the one with malaria. You can tell them you tried, but that means fuck all, doesn't it? You're fired. You know it, and so do I. You had your shot, but now it's over. And since men like you only work for money, you're no longer my problem. You'll have to find something else to do with yourself now. What your old clients don't seem to understand is that they can't kill me. Do you understand what I'm saying? Nobody kills me. Nobody. I'm the one who decides who lives and who dies. Me. You know, there's a book I read a long time ago. I still think about it every day. It helps me understand life out here. The book talks about men and what motivates them. Simple, really. A living being seeks above all else to discharge its strength. Life itself is will to power. Nothing else matters. <laughs> so long. Pagana Chaki! We do first aid before that gets infected. Conquerors, and you're an idiot. Who are you working with? You got some of my guys killed at the hotel, you know that? So now you run errands for me, and I got some things for you to do. Get out here, take what you need. There's ammunition, medicine, whatever. Hurry up.
Captain Lucy. She really hit fan back in Pala. There was supposed to be ceasefire, but that's all out the window now. I work for this big shot Gakumba, local boss for United Front. Everyone I've got who knows us from hole in the ground is out in field fighting the APR. That just leaves you, Erin, boy. So first thing, you need to get piece of shit automobile back on the road. Can you do that, or do you not know us from hole in the ground? Go outside and get the engine running. You know you got malaria, right? So you screw around, you pass out, maybe die. Too bad. God, open up. <laughs>